So if you remember on our last video, we started some seeds here in the shop and it's been, I think three days, so about 72 hours. And I couldn't believe what happened out here. So let me show you real quick. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're so glad that you clicked on our video today and we have a special adventure. It is time to go get those dinosaurs. Yeah, the baby dinosaurs are ready. <laughs> they just got hatched out and I hope they'll fit in the trailer back here. So you can see we got the trailer hooked up and we're going to get on the road and head over there and we'll catch up with you when we pull back in this driveway. Zena can't wait. She's so excited. You guys recognize those goats? You think they know where they're from? I think they probably do. I'm gonna try to pull up just a little bit and get this right here. Okay. When we'll get them in with. Howdy, partner. What'd you get? Your baby dinosaurs? Nope. Yep. Yep. Is that how a cowboy says hi? Yep. Show me. <laughs> well, I better watch out. I better watch out. Let me scoot over. You get over here by you? Zena, what do you think about it? Are you so excited? Oh, Zena's. Are you so excited, Zena? Zena's got friends. You motioning him? He can't see you, baby. We uh, got the trailer. We got baby dinosaurs. Well, we were able to video where we went and got the goats because that guy just wasn't very nice, was he? Well, he had a lot to say to us about other my, stuff, but we got to the goats eventually. And uh, if you're here, you probably already watched that video. So <laughs> that was enough videoing. We're just teasing. We went over to uh, Keeping It Dutch's and got um, his goats. You guys know they're moving and going off grid. And some of you guys maybe came over from that video. And uh, while we loaded goats, the kids played and had a good time. So like I said, you guys know that um, they're going off grid over there. And so they're getting rid of and downsizing a lot of different things. So when we heard he had some goats for sale, uh, we jumped on the opportunity because we knew we were wanting some goats. We got the livestock guardian dog here. And everything was just working out um, in order for that to happen. So Yeah, timing couldn't have been better. So we were just about ready to start looking for goats. And we noticed on his channel that he wasn't going to be able to keep his. So I reached out to him and said, hey, you want to sell some goats? And he said... Absolutely. <laughs> so uh, it worked out really well. I always like to do business with neighbors when you can and he's close enough I consider him a neighbor and we were really excited to get these goats. Yeah and you guys know Hope, Hayden and Hadley over there at Keeping It Dutch. They're excited because they can come and visit the goats and see the goats and who knows when they're ready maybe we can get them some uh, what are they kids? Yeah get some kids back to them. Yeah. That so comes time. Or sell them back. If I can make money off of keeping it Dutch, <laughs> that's what I want to do. Yeah, so let's get these goats unloaded. A lot of you... You need to tell them something? Okay, hang on. A lot of you guys already guessed that we were getting Dutch's goats. Like, you guys get on our secrets before we can even have fun with it. So that's pretty awesome. You guys realize that? Ransom's got to say something. Um, we got my baby dinosaurs. We got your baby dinosaurs? Is that what you're going to call them? <laughs> we're going to have to make a shirt out of that. Ransom's baby dinosaurs and put a goat on it. <laughs> so we got we got to name them, right? Yeah. So let's get them out and let's talk about what their names are going to be. And I named one princess. Oh, I, I'm surprised you didn't name it Grace. Does that sound like a good name now? We should name Jojo. Jojo, what do you think? Princess is good or... Alright, let's get to it. Alright, Ransom, you ready for the baby dinosaurs? Yes. Alright, let's see them. Okay, hey, call Zena over wait. there. See if she'll stay in. Zena! <gasps> Look, here comes your baby dinosaurs. Oh goodness, she about knocked me over. Yeah. Look, Zena. What do you think, Ransom? Zena, Zing Zing. Hey, hey. Jojo, come. Jojo, come. Jojo, come. Jojo. I like my. What do you think, bud? Huh? What do 
you think about that? You're a goat farmer now. He had to have his cowboy hat for this occasion. Oh, they're they're already made themselves at home. They're peeing and pooping all over the place. What you girls think? So there are, there's six does here. Six does. Yep. Oh, here comes the cows. They're like those are some funny looking calves. What do you think, Bub? Good. Zena, what do you think about your new friends? Zena say, uh, what are these? <laughs> Zena never seen a goat before, has she? Uh, Zena's peeing too. Zena's got to pee where they peed. <laughs> Zena, what do you think? <laughs> Your job is to protect them. Oh. What do you think about it? Over there. What do you think, Daddy? I, the, the, I was wondering what the cows would do. They were like, what in the world is going on here? Think, look at that sky. We're supposed to get tornadoes, aren't we? Yes. Yeah, Ooh, look back there. We thought we might get trapped in Dutch's bunker. It's tornado season in Oklahoma, so we got to be weather aware. And we always keep our smartphones handy because if something's coming, they'll definitely let us know. I've got so many alerts in the last hour. Nothing's happened yet. Hey, babies. Can I go pet them? You can sure try. Um, chase them. Hadley said that white one is real friendly. Are goats like pigs? Are they going to go check all the fence and make sure there's no hole? Probably. I don't know. Hey, Mama. They don't know what to think about them. What do you guys think? Never seen any goats before, have you? Well, if you have, it's been a while. Do we have goats and cows on our last farm so, at the same time? This isn't our first experience with goats. We did have uh, boar goats and some mixed breeds about four years ago on our old farm. We also had alpacas, and we don't have any alpacas right now either. Did we have? But did we have the boar goats and the cows at the same time? Yes. I think we did. We yeah, did. we had boar goats and cows at the same time. And we had uh, two sheep. Yes. Ransom, come back here just a little bit. If they get, talking to if them. they think that you're, uh... are you speaking goat language? Yes. <laughs> so, I don't think these goats have ever had a livestock guardian dog in the pen with them. So this is going to be probably something new for them too. Well, I was just thinking, since they haven't had a livestock guardian dog, they might be a little aggressive to her, which would, she needs to know her place, but also, she doesn't need to be rammed. Should we give him some food? We'll give him some in a little Dutch bit. Dutch sent us home once with some goodies. What all was what all was that he put uh, in the just truck? Just different medicines and wormers and stuff that he had that um, would probably expire, so he let us take it home. So we are set up with that goat stuff. And I've got a couple contacts, as you know. Obviously, um, Dutch will always be there for us with any questions, but also Kevin over at Hidden Heights Farm. Uh, he said any questions I have, he'll be happy to help too. So I'm thankful for a community of YouTube people and just regular people to help us out. Hey, Zena. So someone's going to say, I don't see no shelter in there for those goats. So some of you may be wondering, what about the goat shelter? I don't see any place for them to get out of the, uh, the rain. Well, we've got a temporary shelter right here. So we took this old uh, dog kennel, put a tarp over the top, this will keep them out of the rain at least. They also have a bunch of trees right over there um, that will keep them in the shade and more or less out of the weather. So we've got this for now though. And we have another shelter that's on its way. So it should be here in the next month. And I'm going to go over that in a different video so I don't want to get into it too much. But because of all the pandemic stuff it's a little bit behind on getting here. But that shelter should be here soon. So for now this will have to work. What'd you get? An excavator. Nana, Nana left that? Yeah, Nana got me an Xbox card. Oh, goodness. $25 Xbox gift card with checkered boards for all of us, a game. What did Nancy get? She got this big um, stuffed animal hatchimal thing. Oh, my. And um, she all got us emoji wipes. Wipes? What like wet wipes. Hands? Yeah.
So obviously these goats need some names. One's name is Shadow, uh, Dutch told us. The other ones don't uh, have names. So we were thinking Hope, Hayden, Hadley, Brandy, and Dutch Arena. But let us know down below. Uh, what would you name these goats if they were yours? Or coming from Keeping It Dutch, would you name them after his family? Um, or is that rude? I don't think it's rude. I think it's funny. Um, he'd probably name a cow after Gary. So uh, Ranger's out here playing with them. We got something in the shop to update you on. So we're going to let Gary and the boys show you that. Ransom, you want to show them you got that out of the box? Mama, look. Ranger, just don't chase them. Mama, look. All right, Ransom, what did you get out of that box? The excavator. Excavator? And it can turn. Wow, I like that. Hey, where are you heading with the, that, those clothes on? You kind of look like you're going to a cowboy pool party. Nope. Where are you going? Nowhere. Nowhere? I like him. Look, this can dig. What does that arm do? Wow. That's pretty cool. Hey, watch this. So if you remember on our last video, we started some seeds here in the shop and it's been, I think three days, so about 72 hours. And I couldn't believe what happened out here. So let me show you real quick. Can you guys believe that? As you can tell, there was a lot of things that sprouted and they're doing really good right now. But I also threw some other vegetables I already had in there. Um, I bought those tomato plants earlier this week and my mom dropped by these other plants. So I'm gonna play a little trick on the boys and see if they realize that some of those plants weren't the ones we planted. So I'm gonna tell them to come in and look real quick because they haven't seen these since we put them in the ground. So let's see what they say. Ransom, what? remember those seeds we planted? Yeah. You want to come check them out? Some of them sprouted. Let's go. I don't believe it. I bet you they did. Can you guys believe that? Wait. Did you guys plant like Wait, the giant no, bean stalk? No, no, no. That's that. That's not what they are. Random. You guys Look, on steroids. These are fake. These are, these are, we didn't plant these. He just bought them from the store. What do you think about that, Ransom? But this is super bad. fast. Yeah, no, I was just playing a trick on you guys. So, but this is super fast. Look how fast they sprouted. This one is taller. All right, guys. Hey, look at Daddy. So I was playing a trick on you. Some of those didn't plant, but look at the ones we did plant. Look how big they already are. Mazzy, you want to look at this? See how they grew? Ransom, look at that. Daddy, these ones we didn't plant. Daddy bought. Hey, look at these. These are the Ransom sunflowers. They're jokers. Ooh, they're the joker sunflowers. <laughs> is that but, Ransom? I, I'm the dig. Mazzy. No, these, we're not going to dig with that. Hey, these are going to be Mazzy's because they're supposed to be beautiful flowers. The Max flowers. What's their mine? Uh, well, you planted um, these uh, sunflowers right here. Firecracker, I think it was. And you also helped plant the squash. Me Remember too. the Me too. Um, grenade squash? Me too. I'm a grenade and I'm a firecracker. So, and chocolate cherry sunflowers, are they in there? Like, chocolate cherry, yes. Those are the um, CC. CC. CC sunflowers. And when was these? Oh, hey, ketchup. Ransom, when you sprayed all those down with that water bottle, what? Chad said, Ransom, I think you got every bit of it soaked. You didn't miss a spot. You did good, didn't you, bud? This, well, this one's going big. All right. What are those? I just wanted to show you guys hard work. It paid off, didn't it, Squash. Ransom? Mm -hmm. You guys did just right, and now it's there. we're going to have some plants in the garden soon. Now, now Hey, to but it. tomorrow what? we can plant these and we can plant those. You gonna help Daddy plant? Yeah. yeah. All right, we'll get it taken care of. Is this mat warm? Yeah. Oh no. All right, what game are you playing, Maz? Playing soccer, soccer with these humongous balls. Soccer? You guys be careful. Don't kick oh, Ransom in the oh, face. Hang on. A little break. So, guess where we got this? Where? We got this ball from Great Wolf Lodge. Um, and if you haven't seen the video, 
look it up and just watch that. You had a lot of fun there, didn't you guys? Yep. yep. All right. And I got the puppy thing. You're going to make people dizzy all bouncing around, Ransom. <laughs> Ready? Let's play soccer. Okay. Let's go. I'm afraid of goalie. You're on Magic Team. I'm like a goalie. You're going to be going on Magic Whoa! Oh, good job. Let Ransom shoot it. Let Ransom shoot it. All right, Ransom. Let's see your best shot, buddy. I'm the goalie, Ransom. Daddy's getting dizzy just watching this. Really? Let's see it. Whoa! Whoa! Hard shot. Good job, guys. Oh, that was a big shot. All right, Zena. This is your bowl. Look. This is your food, girl. Good girl. I always try to pet her a little bit. That way she doesn't become too aggressive about her food. We want her to be aggressive to certain things, but not to us, so... I always just kind of pet her a little bit. And then I got some feet for the goats. Come on, goats! Come on, goats! Oh, Hayden, uh, Hadley, Brandy, Dutch Arena, or is it Duchess? Shadow! Goats, 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 goats! How do you call goats, guys? We don't know how to call goats. I don't know, but she do not need to be eating that. Hey! Here goats. Come on, goats. There they come. Come on, goats. There you go. Try it out. They all got their own little slot. Wait, there's five slots and six goats. They'll get it figured out. They're all going to eat from one side. So it looks like they're nice and settled in. Like we said, Dutch sent us home with some different things, wormers and stuff like that. He also told us to uh, get with Kevin and see some different things they use. Rachel just put out a video and I actually watched it the other day. And um, we're going to go back and look in more detail because I can't remember the name of the, the feed or anything. Um, but we're going to go back and check out that video that Rachel did over at Hidden Heights Farm. Um, because uh, we want to make sure we're giving the goats exactly what they need and the best stuff out there. So... Um, like Gary said, we're just real appreciative that we have so many different friends that we can go to and ask for goat advice because we're cattle people, not really goat people, even though we've had them in the past. So, She's, Zena's trying to figure out boundaries and all that. Zena? What do you think, girl? That's their feed. Yours is over there. Huh? They going to be your new friends? I can't believe how fast she's growing. Oh, and you guys remember um, the puppy that I met some subscribers um, at the local gas station and they named him Kane. They sent me videos of Kane the other day out with the chickens and they had actually brought him in the house because it was supposed to storm. Um, and then they showed him out with the chickens and Kane is doing amazing. Also, the dog that went to um, Wichita to the family with five kids, I think it was. They sent me some pictures the other day. Spoiled, doing awesome. So all the puppies are doing great. And as you can see, the goats are doing great as well. We want to thank you guys for watching. We're going to get in and take a look at this weather um, on the news. Make sure everything's good. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit that bell for notifications. You guys have a great, great day, and God bless. What do you think, Zena? Huh? So Ransom heard Cassie ending the video, and he wasn't having that, were you? He said, I want to say God bless. So what do you want to say, brother? God bless. What do you what, what else you want to say? Um, I want my new excavator. Look inside of it. Wow. And look at look at the troll pipes and the arm. That's cool, man. I think everybody likes that. Okay. All right. You like your new baby dinosaurs? Yeah. Those are goats. No, oh, they're goats. You were tricking people, weren't you? You're a trickster. All right.